So I just finished doing uh, my really pretty outside around Harlexton video. Check that out if you haven't seen it because it should be the video before this or after it. I'm not sure. Just look around. Uh, <laughs> me and Veronica are here uh, walking around Harlexton uh, and I'm going to show you the inside now. But um, this is the outside, obviously. I mean, you saw it in the video that I just posted. But it's a really pretty day out today, so I figured that this would be the day that I would do all of my walking around of business and such. But I have to close the gate. Oof. There. Be on the stairs. And be careful on the stairs because they're slippery. Because it's wet. Thanks, English weather. Uh, there's one of my favorite little lions in the manor itself. Now the funny thing is, there's a really big front door, and we've only used it once. It's symbolic. It's symbolic. <laughs> um, I don't even think we'll exit through the front door when we leave. But, um, no, we're probably going to go through the door we're about to go through. Yeah, but because there's the American flag and the Union Jack. To go to Italy. And uh, there's the front door. And that we've only used once. And I'll show you where that actually goes because that'll be on our tour. But we're going to go through the side door. The refectory is over there. So that building that you see right there, that, well, that part of the building, is where the refectory is, which is, uh, you know, where we eat and stuff. And I'll a cafeteria, cafeteria. If you're American. Yeah. But we won't be able to show that because they lock it up when there's no meals going on, which doesn't really make sense, really. But anyway, this is how we're going in. It's a little side entrance. And reception. Yes. Oh, see, there's the bells. But see, we have these key fobs. Everything. So we're able to do it. The refectory is right there, so you would go in there. Through there is where we live. <laughs> It'll be to the carriage house, but I'll show you that later. This is the Schroeder Lounge, which is just a place for people to hang out. Mailboxes. <laughs> mine is right there. Oh, no, this one. 53. That's mine. And Veronica, you got mail recently, didn't you? Uh, no. Oh, well, I thought you did. I got mail from my dad. Well, here's the creepy ass elevator. Like, the other lift. It's like seriously one of those, like, legitimate, like. Yes, it's still broken. Wow. Is it broken? Don't do that. That's terrifying. But, um, it's like one of those, like, reels, like. Lift where you have to. Oh, it is? Oh, it isn't. Oh, it was all the way up. So, yeah, you can see it coming down. We're not taking it up, however, because it's terrifying. Um, but it's like one of those serious ones that you like, like have to close yourself into. Those are, sorry, Veronica. Those are the main stairs. That's me. And you go through this door. There's another lounge over there that a lot of people hang out in where they play snooker and everything. Yeah, the junior common room. This is our board where a lot of our si like sign-in sheets and whatever like for when we signed up for our seating arrangements for the valedictory dinner. There's our table. Focus. 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 Technical difficulties. Yeah, there we go. But I will show you the area in which we frequent. This, my friends, is called the Nook. Whenever I say I'm in the Nook, this is what I mean. This is the Nook. And usually that chair is supposed to be down there, but for some reason, somebody moved it and put an ottoman there instead. So I've been sitting on an ottoman. But this is where we are. Hold this for a second, Veronica. I'm going to climb up just very elegantly. Oh. Well done, Kana. But this is where I signed my name because Miss Hannah Gannot signed it there. And she's, yeah, she's the reason I came. 
So that's really cool. I love it. And it's really warm up here. So we're gonna get down. But yeah, this is the view outside of the knock. This is where Abby, Veronica, and I congregate often. Take this so I can get back down. Kane is gracefully getting down. Yes. I will I will say that. Yes. My graceful self. And these are like telephones and then random ass microwaves. <laughs> but so Hello. Hey. <laughs> this is called the Stone Corridor. In which it is stone. This is where the servants used to run back and forth to get to the other places in the manor where it's like secretly so that you wouldn't know that they were there. We'll come back to that place. This is the Colton room. This is where I have my environmental science class, which meets Mondays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays. Every day but today. And keep this staircase in mind because we will come back to it. Well, we won't come back to it, but I will tell you where this leads when we get there because we're going to go the other way. But, and then down there is one of Veronica's classrooms and the music room. Yeah, the music room and housekeeping and the nurse and all that good stuff. Okay, so this area. That's it's what we call the posh bathroom. Yeah. Which, which I guess I could show you. The posh bathroom is pretty cool. It's one of my favorite colors. Yeah. Oh gosh. Good job. <laughs> the door. <laughs> um, this is the posh bathroom though. But because it's got like a whole downstairs area and like a whole other room. And I'm pretty sure it's like where like a bride would get ready with her bridal party but so there's that that's the posh bathroom anyway that's where the head of housekeeping is okay now this room this is the main foyer because those are the main doors that we only came in through once but when we came in this is the first thing that we saw. <laughs> yeah, I saw me. Yes, that was the first thing that yeah, I saw. We did all sit here yeah, we did. 5%. And took a picture. And it was wonderful. Someone else took but, a picture of us, I think. Yeah. I think it was one of the um, one of the actual photographers. Um, there's a great Grecian urn up there. Yes. A great Grecian urn. But anyway, we'll go up these stairs because this is how we actually entered Harlickston for the first time. We're on these wonderful stairs. Anything is better than St. Paul Cathedral. Yes. And word to the wise, there are a lot of stairs here. <laughs> but these stairs are gorgeous. But you have wonderful things to look at as you climb the stairs. We'll go through here. We have to go through my favorite room. Yeah, my favorite room. room. Well, before we go into my favorite room, where we were, the little nook. Oh, hello. Hi. That was my environmental science professor. <laughs> <laughs> um, if you come down those stairs, that's where we were earlier to get to the nook. So anyway, here we go. We're going back now. To my favorite room, which is this room, which is the Great Hall and its wonderfulness. I believe I already have a video of the actual Great Hall on my YouTube account. You got the chandelier. I did, yes. Just the Phantom of the Opera. Like <laughs> yeah, pulling Anastasia. This is the fireplace and the room that was in the haunting, which is probably why it's one of my favorites. Ooh, moving chairs. <laughs> <laughs> that like Harry Potter. 
No. This is the cedar staircase. And it's fabulousness. I mean, look at this. Do you remember what it's a mixture of? Uh, Baroque styles and all that good stuff. Neo-Elizabethan. Neo the gold room's in there. That's the room that I have my uh, British Studies seminar in. I have intergroup relations in there. You do? Mm -hmm. It's a really pretty room. I'll pop in quickly <laughs> while well, as they're moving chairs out of the room. But this room is very gold and very elaborate and with pink accents and really creepy babies. <laughs> and really big mirrors, like, like hall of mirror yeah. kind of things. I but you should get your shot in that mirror. Yeah. <laughs> but. Uh, oh really? But up the cedar staircase is how you get to the. Yeah, to more creepy babies and other rooms, like for housing and everything. That's the state dining room. I mean, it's a really pretty room that looks out to the front of the manor. But I don't have any classes in there. They've been redecorating. They're in the process of redecorating. Shows that you constantly have facelifts in places like this. This is the long gallery. Obviously named because it is long. <laughs> uh, this is where we have our British Studies lecture. And this is also where I have Shakespeare. So that's yeah, always fun. Fantasy yes, fantasy lit on there. And they're getting ready for Thanksgiving, I think. Oh, really? Because well, that's why all the chairs are back there. Oh, that would make sense. <laughs> I'm not positive, but it seems likely. <laughs> yes. We're They're about to have, stuff. we're about to have, well, not today. I think it's tomorrow. Well, Kane is about to have. Yeah, I'm going to have Thanksgiving dinner tomorrow. And it's going to be wonderful. And I'm excited. But this is the long gallery. And then out that way is the conservatory, which I think we'll pop out into. Because it's wonderful. You, yeah, have, it's worth a you have your keys, correct? Yeah. Good. Because they lock these doors the same way they lock the outside doors. So it's like you do that, and then... Uh, you open it up, and then you close it back, and so it's like magnetic locks. So if you don't have your keys, you're stuck out here. Fun fact, when me and Abby did her walk around, they had shut off these two areas. Really? So go through them. Yeah. Well, I don't know why. Yeah. The conservatory is very pretty, and it's got lots of plants, obviously, because it's a conservatory. But we're going to go visit some of my other friends. You want to say hi to my friends? Hi, friends. My little fishy friends. But yeah, this is the conservatory. And it's, it's nice and cool out here, which is not a bad thing because it was getting warm in there. But yes. But it's really pretty in here. I wish I would spend more time out here, but with the manor being as big as it is. We don't even live here. Yeah, we don't even live here. We live in the carriage house. But. That sounded hard. Oh, yeah. There we go. <laughs> anyway, long gallery. There's this place, and this always freaks me out. I always forget there's a mirror here, and then I end up scaring myself. <laughs> but this takes you back out into where the gold room is and the cedar staircase. Yes, and this, you remember that staircase that I told you to keep in mind? This is where it comes out. So it's like a secret passage. Not a secret passage, but it's where the servants came back and forth and it's our shortcut to get to class on time actually but the beautiful stained glass windows of the great hall which is again my favorite room <laughs> yes we spend a lot of time in here actually 
or I do at least, because it's my favorite room. But we'll pop into the state dining room one more time just to just to peek. Because another way how you get into the state dining room is this way. These are the stairs that we just walked up. And we have lots of paintings and wonderful things. And there's the outside parlor extending in. I'll give a quick turn around because I know that people are in here. Hello. Hello. <laughs> so the ceiling's gorgeous. And this is the really big round window that you always see out front. So when you're looking at the big round window, you know where it is now. <laughs> and that man is probably thinking, wow, these kids are really weird. <laughs> but it's okay. I'm fine with being weird. And accurate. <laughs> yes. But. Oh, look, it's my favorite room again. Woohoo. We're walking by it this time. Now, I'm only going to show you this because it's cool. Veronica takes these stairs to go up to her seminar. But these are, is there a specific name for these stairs? Uh, yeah, I think that's what they call them. But they go up to what is called the blue core, which I guess we could show. I mean, it's a lot of stairs, but it's okay. We never come up here because, um, these are, there's no need, there's no need to come up here. Um, I'm not going to show you the, like, 200s and the 300s. Um, but I mean, I guess we'll be showing a little bit of it though. Um, but what I'm about to show you is where the professors live, but it's like the classic level of Harlexton. So it's worth a look because it's really pretty. It's called the Blue Corridor, blue and gold. You'll, you'll see, you'll see why. why. <laughs> but. Here we go. We are quite literally in the heart of the manor. There's more rooms. But this is, this isn't the hallway. This is the hallway I was talking about. Ta-da! Blue and gold. Just for reference. This is where we are in the manor now. So. A great picture of Jesus on the wall. Yep. Pro Jesus. Sup, Jesus. But yeah. So this is the. Oh, there. You get a look <laughs> at one of the rooms. <laughs> but this is where visiting faculty live, isn't it? Do, you, uh, Do regular faculty live here too? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I know, I, I'm positive that visiting faculty lives here. I'm not so positive that. But. The door is gorgeous. And surprisingly easy to open. And surprisingly easy to open. This is where we are at now, just for reference. So that's the front gate. Up there, I'm not gonna go up there. Cause you don't need to see up there. Cause those are just, yeah. Cause those are just where other students live and stuff like that. It's not very fascinating. It's just a lot of woodwork similar to that even though that's a dresser, but it's similar to that. It's not very elaborate. It's just where a lot of other Harlexton students live. But this, however, is the top part of the cedar staircase. So as you can see, we're closer to the really elaborate ceiling. And there's the dome with the wonderful people who are clearing out the rooms. Babies have mermaid legs. Do they? Which is weird. Oh yeah, they do. Oh, Gregory, yeah. Gregory, Gregory was just like, you know what? And if you look that? there, that's the floor plan of Harlexton. And I don't know if you can see it, but this angel has a scythe. <laughs> and so, yeah, that's really interesting. <laughs> we don't really know what Gregory Gregory was smoking when he made all of this wonderfulness. I don't know if he was smoking it, but I'm pretty sure some acid was smoking. Yes. Well, we'll go down these stairs, though. So we'll go down these wonderful stairs. 
I feel like I'm just making big circles, but that's what this manor does. It makes big circles. So you have to, you have multiple ways of getting to each class. And you have to try and figure it out. Unless you're trying to go outside. Unless you're trying to go to the carriage house. Then there's no there's pretty much only one way to get to the carriage house. But we went, we exited that way last time. So we're going to go this way. So you'll get to see what we do every day. Well, not every day. Close to every day. But these are the days. Yeah. Firewood. But these are the servant stair case, I suppose. There's reference. It leads outside. Boy. But yes, and so now we're back in the stone corridor. That way's the music room and where the nurse is, and then there's the culprit room again. So we've made a full circle. You can go to the back side of the building. Right? To the library? To, yeah. That's, that's right. where I'm headed now. Yeah. 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 Planning ahead. Plans and stuff. Plans and stuff. But yeah, so. Oh, yeah, and there's a telephone booth for local calls. Um, not very much anything of interest back here. There's another um, lounge. And then this is the movie room and the music room and a haunting poster, which made me really happy when I first came here. Yeah. And, but now we're going to show you the library briefly. But that other set of stairs that we passed coming this way comes out there. And then if you go up that area, uh, that's what takes you to the Great Hall and everything again. See, everything makes a circle. But this is how we get to the library. And if you go up that staircase, that takes you to more rooms that houses Harlickston so students. Right now. Yeah, that's what we're learning right now. And all the prime ministers, which is also what we're learning right now. Yeah, that's where we keep Harry Potter. That's the British faculty office. I would go poke my head in and make all the professors say hi, but Veronica would say that'd be weird. <laughs> it would be. But this is the library. I'm going to do a quick peek because there's people here. But it used to be a kitchen. Yeah, this is where the kitchen used to be. But shh, it's a library. Which reminds me, I need to turn in my books. <laughs> but no one's ever quiet in that library. No, 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 one, no one's ever quiet. <laughs> but British faculty office again. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, we've pretty much shown you all of the manner that is used often. I mean, there's the you know, the parts that the students live in, but other than that, I've basically shown you all the classrooms and stuff. So I guess we'll go home, but we'll take this way. So that's where we came up this time. And so this is where we're coming up this time. But that's how you get to the great hall and everything. And you see the board? How they... Question mark, question mark, question mark. <laughs> <laughs> There's the nook again. So. As you see, the theme of Harvestin is one big circle. But exactly, the nook is a great meeting place because all roads lead to the nook, which we will be visiting shortly. Yes. Yeah, that's where I send my postcards that I don't manage to get out before we leave the countries that we're visiting. So this is how we get to the carriage house. We have to walk outside in the cold. Anyway, it's not, it feels good right now. Yeah, that's, so why, it's not too bad. that's why the jacket came off. But this is, that's the library. 
just so you get reference as to where everything is. These are the shuttles that take us from here to Grantham, so they take us into town. Behind it is where Dr. Yes, Kingsley Yes, this, this area of the manor is the, I guess, I guess you'd call it the president's suite. Oh, well, it's yeah. called the principal's lodge. That's what, what it says on that Close little enough. sign. <laughs> Mine sounded better. <laughs> but we have to go through this, um, I don't know what you would call it. I don't so know what this, this used Pegasus to be. Tower, yeah, it? this is Pegasus Tower, which is also lived in by It says no entry, someone. but we're rebels, so. Yeah. But yeah, we have to walk through here, and usually we have to be careful because you see these speed bumps. Well, speed bumps are called humps in England. Really? I didn't know that. <laughs> oh, you didn't? No. Well, yeah, speed bumps are called humps in England, and we usually have to walk on the sidewalk because cars fly through here. And as we all know, Kana and cars don't mix it's very either well. One or the other. They either go really fast or they go like snail so pace. So slow. So it's like. Yeah. You always have to watch out. Can you just drive a normal speed? Yeah. That's the smoker's table. <laughs> That's the one table smokers the one are allowed, table smokers to, smoke are allowed to smoke at. And then if you take that road up, you go into the woods, which is where me, Abby, and Veronica take me to go sing <laughs> when people aren't on campus. I like how you included you in taking yourself. Yes, I take, I take myself to go sing. But this is how we get down to the carriage house. Very short walk. But it's it a feels nice walk. long if you're tired and or cold. Yes, but it's very nice at the moment. It's very nice. And there's Camille. Say hi. hi. <laughs> <laughs> that was the girl who. Oh no, she's who I hung out with when I had a layover in Toronto. So, but anyway, this is the carriage house. They're doing some work on it. So, but I mean, it's England. So I mean, when are they not doing work on anything? But. Because it's everything's old. But this is the carriage house. And it's got little green patches and trees and benches and construction. <laughs> All that good stuff. Well, but <laughs> yeah, you can go through. Um, well, that's a separate apartment for one of the visiting faculty that have kids here. But um, there's other doors that you can go into. My room is like approximately right there on the back side. And Veronica's is like approximately there on the back side. <laughs> but we all go through the main door because all three of us, like me, Veronica, and Abby, usually come in together. But I'll show you the lounge where we hang out. If nobody's in there. Nobody's in there. That's good. But this is the lounge that we hang out in. Um, this is where Veronica, Abby, and I, and Nick, and Kirsten watch movies, <laughs> and, and or Doctor Who, and or Teen Wolf, and or Community, depends on what fad Nick is interested in at the moment, <laughs> so, but, uh, More that's, like whatever Abby recommends. Yeah, but, uh, that's the boys in the hallway. Ew. Ew. <laughs> But down here, oof, is also the laundry. So, laundry, 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 dryer, dryer, dryer. Um, so, that's where we have to do laundry. And it's downstairs, and we live upstairs, so that's always fun. This is the kitchen, quote unquote. Um, we have a microwave and a sink. That's what our kitchen is. And then we have the Pepsi machine that is never on. It's not still on. <sighs> I've been craving carbonation for like a year. Well, okay, it has been a year because I've had carbonation all throughout the semester, but it's like I haven't had it in like over a week and I'm craving it really bad. But anyway, so these are the stairs that we normally come up. And Kirsten should be at her post. Oh, look, she is. Kirsten is at her post. What? Wave. Are you talking about me? Yeah. This is YouTube. Oh, hi, YouTube. Yes. <laughs> this is the computer lab that we have in the carriage house. And Kirsten has made her home here. Yes. Because this piece of crap doesn't always work. 
yeah. but anger. This is the Skype room, but oh, that was pretty. yeah, you can see where it is in relation. Those are the front gates, but it's a lovely dance move, Kirsten. But yeah, this upper floor is all girls. Yay! I always make faces at her when I go by because she's always there, so I always make fun of her. But we're coming down the hallway. This is Veronica's room. You want to show them your room? Is Amy asleep? Amy, what? Are you asleep? No. Okay. <laughs> Say hi. <laughs> this is my third my third roommate. YouTube. <laughs> Mostly my parents. Aww, maybe some friends. Aww, that's good. Yeah. But that's that's where I usually reside when I'm in here because I am the third roommate. Yep. I apologize. Nope, it's okay. <laughs> but yeah, so this is Veronica's room and Amy's room. But oh no, it's a mess mostly. <laughs> on your side? <laughs> Apparently you don't look at my side. <laughs> but they're 645, so. Any hoozle. Okay, fire can. <laughs> this is coming down the other. Look, a mirror. Uh, but this is coming down the other corridor. This is Kirsten's room. And. Uh, Abby and I draw on it often. I almost said Audie. Audie and I, but Audrey's not here. That's not the first time that that's happened. This is the bathroom. I want to see if there's anyone here. No, okay, good. Okay, anyway, these are the bathrooms. This, this is how it's set up. Um, these are our showers. And well, they have this. Like here, and I don't no, here. Veronica doesn't shower in here. But those are small. That's the one I always use. Abby is, always uses that one, so it's really funny. But um, anyway. That's the bathroom, and uh, I mean, it's a little awkward that I've brought a video into the bathroom, but I wanted to show you the no, it dorm life. In there. Yeah, it's like if someone was taking a shower, that'd be bad. Yeah, if someone's going to the bathroom, that'd be bad. Yeah, but that's Abby's room, and I drew an abigator. But yeah, that's Abby's room. And we will come to an end of the tour with my room. What are you doing? Oh, hi, Abby! No, now you gotta show us yeah, your Yeah, we gotta show us your room. Oh, no. You're committed. <laughs> Open up. Did you get your paper done? Yeah, I did. Good. Oh, this is Jordan. This is Abby's roommate. Hi. <laughs> uh, so yeah, that's Abby's side. My side really messy. <laughs> Apparently, no one's seen my side. <laughs> but those are their beds, and YouTube is wonderful, and... Anyway, now we're gonna end the tour with my with my room. But um, this is my room, my little corner room. Mine's actually bigger than a lot of people's. But anyway, if you go down here, this is how I get down all the time. You see that outside? It takes you out to the corner. So it's like there's that wall there, and then you walk up that way to get to the manor. So anyway, this is mine, and I have a Jay and Barry quote. But yeah, this is my room. Hi, Jessica. Hi. I'm going to turn the light on really quick because I'm giving a tour of our room. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but, yeah, our, my room's messy as well. But, say hi, Jessica. No, no. <laughs> no, no. See, we want someone to have that reaction because everyone else would like to go see what That's my like, desk. Okay, and I would have been that's like, Jessica's desk. No. Our room's really messy right now. My Superman poster. I already gave you a tour of my room, but... This is where the tour ends. Say hi, Jessica. Hi. <laughs> but YouTube. No, take it off. <laughs> but this was the tour of Harlexton, my daily routine, basically. No. <laughs> but there's my board with all of my wonderful notes from people and everything and. That's Harlexton.